Welcome to the Maternity Mentor. Today we will be talking about hand expression of your breast milk and how to do it so you can increase your milk supply quickly. Stay with us. Hi, I'm Samantha. I'm a board certified nurse practitioner and I have over 13 years nursing experience working in mother baby postpartum, NICU, antepartum and labor and delivery. I'm also an IBCLC, a maternal newborn nursing certified, and I have received training in perinatal mood and anxiety disorders as well as perinatal bereavement. Hand expression is a very effective technique to increase your milk supply, but many moms don't know how to do it. Let's explore why you should consider hand expression and demonstrate how to do it. Hand expression is also referred to as manual expression. It's a technique that's been utilized for decades to help a woman provide breast milk to her baby. Hand expression is when you express breast milk from your breasts using your own hands. It is a useful tool for new mothers to have when breastfeeding because hand expression can be used to collect breast milk instead of using an electric or manual pump. Research has also shown that hand expression will actually increase your milk supply. Additionally, hand expression in the first few days of life will usually yield a good amount of colostrum while an electric pump often doesn't produce anything. This is especially helpful when trying to feed a sleepy or medically fragile newborn. There are many reasons to use hand expression. Hand expression is a free, convenient way to express breast milk. You don't need any special equipment to hand express except a storage container. If you need to express your milk and your regular pump is not available, your hands always will be. This also applies if you don't have access to electricity or your batteries are dead. For mothers who have a slower breast milk letdown, Placing their baby skin to skin and using hand expression can boost the milk ejection reflex or let down faster. When a mother becomes engorged, she often can't get any milk using an electric breast pump because the milk ducts are compressed shut by the extra fluid in the breast. Hand expression can help manually open up the ducts and allow the milk to escape and aid in softening the breasts. Finally, Hand expression when used either by itself or in combination with an electric breast pump has been shown to increase a woman's milk supply. This is referred to as hands-on pumping. It's a technique where a mother hand expresses first, then she uses an electric pump, and then she hand expresses again at the end of the session. Studies have shown that this dramatically and rapidly increases a woman's breast milk supply especially if started within six hours of birth. This is recommended when pumping for a preemie, medically fragile, or newborn baby who is not breastfeeding. These babies need every drop of colostrum they can get, and hand expression is a delicate way to collect the colostrum so that none of it gets lost on the sides of big bottles or gets caught in tubing. Before we continue, please remember to hit the like button and subscribe so you can get our latest content to have a happy and healthy family. Now let's show you how to hand express your breast milk. Hand expression starts with washing your hands. Then you want to find a comfortable place to sit and relax. Your breasts respond best to warm human hands. I recommend gently rubbing your hands together or using a warm towel first. Start with a gentle massage all over the breast. This sends the signal to your milk to be ready to flow. Then place your hand on your breast using a C shape where your finger and thumb are positioned on the outside of the areola. With your other hand, you want to place your clean collection container just under the nipple. If collecting colostrum for a newborn, a small plastic medicine cup or spoon may be ideal. Now, you are going to press your finger and thumb towards your chest. Then compress the breast between your fingers and thumb and roll them forward towards the nipple. Make sure to keep your finger and thumb on the breast at all times while you roll forward. This compression should be gentle. If you squeeze too hard, it will hurt and bruise the breast and no milk will come out. 
Once you reach the nipple, release the compression, but keep your hand on your breast. Push back again, compress, roll forward, and continue to repeat the process. After a few cycles in one spot, lift your finger and thumb, rotate your hand, and reposition in a different part of your breast. Start the hand expression cycle again. When the milk stops flowing, find a new position and repeat the process. You should repeat areas you have previously hand expressed until the whole breast feels soft and comfortable and the milk has stopped flowing. Then you want to switch to your other breast. Many women will switch back and forth during the session as this yields the most milk for them. The whole process of hand expression will take approximately 20 to 30 minutes. Relaxation is a key component of hand expression. To start, make sure you find a quiet, private place to hand express. Keep the temperature warmer because milk flows better when the breasts are warm. Play some soothing music and try some aromatherapy to promote relaxation. Place a picture of your baby near you while you hand express. This can encourage the milk to let down faster and flow easier. Other tips to keep baby in mind include placing a blanket that smells like them across your shoulders and playing a video on your phone of your baby babbling and cooing. Leaning forward slightly can utilize gravity in your favor, allowing the milk to flow easier into your chosen container. Be gentle with your breasts. Harder compression and squeezing do not elicit more milk and definitely don't squeeze the nipple. Squeezing the tip of the nipple causes bruising and damage that could lead to bleeding and mastitis. Additionally, this will not express any breast milk. Hand expression works best when you hand express for less time and have more sessions per day. Finally, when you've collected all that precious milk, be sure to feed it to the baby right away. If you are planning to store it, make sure to store your breast milk properly. For more information on the proper storage and handling of your breast milk, please see our video on this. We will link that in the description below. Hand expression is a skill that takes time to practice. Practicing in the morning is ideal when your milk supply tends to be the highest. When you hand express, remember milk will not always start flowing right away. Stick with it. Massage your breasts for a few minutes and try again. This can encourage your letdown. At first, hand expression may be a lot of trial and error until you learn how to do it. However, don't wait too long to try to figure it out. If you haven't been successful at hand expression after a couple days, it's time to seek out some expert help. Contact your healthcare provider or a lactation consultant for some one-on-one -on -one hand expression education. You should also contact an expert if you're experiencing pain while hand expressing. This is usually a sign of poor technique, but it is not normal and should be checked out. It may be a sign of mastitis or a plugged duct. Hand expression is an extremely effective way to collect breast milk and build a milk supply. I hope this has explained how to hand express your breast milk and shown you why you should consider this technique while breastfeeding. Please share your comments and let us know what topics you would like to hear more about. If you like this content, please remember to hit that like button and subscribe so you can be the first to receive this information. Remember to share this channel with your friends and family and follow us on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter for additional content. We will link those in the description below. Thank you so much for joining us at The Maternity Mentor.